Everybody needs a passion in life, a quest, if you will. I give out my people credit for bringing the bluebirds back from the brink of extinction. Now we're going to save the brown-headed nuthatch with the help of Audubon Society. The brown-headed nuthatch needs our help. It's a bird that's declining where we live, and the biggest problem is the loss of nesting cavities. The brown-headed nuthatch is our smallest nuthatch, and a lot of folks are familiar with nuthatches. All of our nuthatches in North Carolina are kind of regular visitors to bird feeders. Uh, they're the little birds that tend to walk upside down on the tree trunks. They are incredibly cute. They're only about four inches uh, big. They're, so they're, they're a small bird. They have this cute little brown head, obviously. And probably their cutest feature is their squeaky toy voice. And if you really look at their numbers in the Piedmont Crescent, you know, from Charlotte, Winston to Raleigh, their numbers are declining about two to three percent per year over the last 20 years or so. So we've lost a lot of them in this kind of developed part of the state. This particular bird species, you know, it's kind of our bird. It only lives in the southeastern United States. One in seven that lives in the whole world lives in North Carolina, and we need to keep it that way or even make that a bigger number. And, and part of their problem was they're such tiny little birds, they build a nest and then the bigger birds take it away from them or take the sight away. Brown-headed nuthatches will use nest boxes as well. The difference is it's a smaller bird and so it needs a smaller hole. <laughs> and so if you think about a bluebird sized hole, inch and a half or so, a brown-headed nuthatch likes the same size box but only a one inch or a one and an eighth inch hole, just a much tinier hole because he's a much smaller bird. Um, it's really important for these cavity nesting birds like a brown-headed nuthatch to have a place to, to raise their babies and to roost uh, overnight. Um, they'll start using that box as soon as it becomes available, if, if they need it. Um, so if you miss the spring nesting season, put up a box. If it's winter, put up a box. It's very easy to put up a brown-headed nuthatch box. You can put it on a pole with a um, squirrel guard or a snake guard underneath, or you can screw it into the side of a tree. By providing them a place to nest and raise their young, uh, we can reverse the decline in their populations in the Piedmont. And so we need your help to do that. And we find that nest boxes, um, you know, 80% of them or so get occupied in the first year or two after putting them up. So you can be really successful in helping this bird um, but just by putting up a nuthatch box. Audubon North Carolina, as part of our bird-friendly communities effort, has established a goal of putting up 10,000 brown-headed nuthatch boxes across North Carolina. To, to reach that goal for this, for this year, for 2014, we need everybody that's in this to put up a box. Join the flock in conserving brown-headed nuthatches. Visit our website for more information on buying or building a nest box. Ah!